Welcome Aries to your September love bonus reading. If you are new to my channel, welcome to Charlie Tarot and feel free to subscribe. So if you are new, how we do things here is we're going to use the AF Tarot deck to pull some energies, do some tarot. At the end of the reading, we are going to pull the lovers of oracles. We also are going to pull the hidden truth messages, which I feel gets more in depth in your person's true feelings. And I love this deck. It's called the Divine Love Oracle, and I feel that this brings more clarity. It's by the Serendipity Tarot. So let's go ahead and get started with your reading and see what is coming in for you guys. What is coming in for Aries? Ooh, look at that. We have the Empress coming in upright, centered, and abundant. We have the Three of Cups energy, which is compassion and happiness. And we have the tower in reverse here. Okay. And the six of wands and the nine of swords. We do have a king of cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces coming in. Keep in mind this reading may not resonate with every single one of you. So please take what resonates with you and leave the rest behind. All right, Aries, let's see what's coming in. We do have the Knight of Wands on the bottom of the deck. We have the Lovers. Awesome. The Knight of Pentacles. The World. The Six of Cups. Okay. The Seven of Swords. Judgment. The Eight of Cups. Very strong message. And we have the Nine of Pentacles. We have the Knight of Wands, the Queen of Wands. There you are. And the Nine of Cups, the Knight of Cups, and Death card. Okay. Okay, Aries. There's definitely some conflict here with the Nine of Swords um and the six of wands so there could be somebody recognizing you here as you're over here as the empress um i feel like you are taking your power back knowing your worth centering yourself this is the uh, goddess of the deck type of energy okay we do have the three of cups so we do have a very strong connection here you could be dealing with three people but i do feel like someone here is not able to let the tower fall now this tower is in reverse so someone could be resisting a change um now this does show some endings here coming in with um the death card um, as something else is coming in like something new with this knight of cups energy which i feel is that cancer scorpio pisces energy you don't have to be dealing with an energy like that but it's very romantic energy and it's a wish fulfillment here after some type of ending okay we do have the nine of cups so again this is your desires your dreams but there's something here which i feel um someone is not able to close out a chapter it could be somebody from the past because we do have the six of cups maybe someone that is still linked to you in a way um not able to get over you at this time I feel like you are on the pursuit to something, okay? I feel like you are, you know, going towards more of an a, a energy like that, uh, that cups energy with your emotions. So something definitely sparked your interest here to where you feel like you are, you know, carrying yourself as the queen of wands, feeling very attractive and confident, um, especially when you're in this lover's car. Now you could be moving on to a new relationship or a higher level of commitment here with someone. Um, we do have a Taurus Virgo Capricorn, the Knight of Pentacles. So things are going very smoothly. I feel if you are dealing with someone, um, are starting things with a, 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 a new love here because this is a connection that is happening but then you have this other energy that is in the world in the challenge so there's a chapter that is hard to close um, that possibly had a tower or some type of betrayal here 
um, and this person is not taking it very well as we have the nine of swords they're recognizing that you are very happy within the situation now they could be very sneaky with this energy when coming into wanting to communicate with you okay um, maybe this was someone who wasn't uh, didn't have the best intentions uh, this past person I feel but they're wanting to connect they're either having an awakening or feeling pulled towards you two or maybe you could even be feeling like a choice between two lovers that's for some of you um, but what you don't see coming is this knight of cups energy uh, which is emotionally walking away from this individual and I feel like you're the one that is walking away and this person is having a very hard time here with this tower moment as they're in their head as you, you are b more they're looking at you as like a very attractive here okay the outcome does show the nine of pentacles so you are feeling whole within yourself okay so you could be either be single or maybe dating someone and taking things to the next level but there's definitely like patience here with this knight of pentacles i don't feel like you're really jumping in that fast um i feel like you're more enjoying the climb with this other person if you are dealing with somebody but the nine of pentacles is being independent and feeling whole within yourself being happy you know as somebody else is lingering from the past here so you guys could be getting a message but i feel like you're emotionally walking away that could have been this ending here here. okay this death card um, which wasn't very easy to do but it led you to someone coming into your life whatever that may be for you okay which is are going towards more of a um, wish fulfillment here so really wonderful things that are happening for you Aries I just feel like someone's coming in with not the best intentions they could be you know very either jealous or feeling as if they feel betrayed or some way um, to where now they're having this awakening here to now they're they're in this like stressful mode and not able to let go completely because the tower again is in reverse so it's not letting it's not it's they're having a hard time closing out this chapter which is the world right feeling confident to move forward and that's the this is why because of the tower in the re reverse so let's see what this person has to say to you you didn't see my tears i hide my feelings definitely someone is hiding their feelings okay because it feels like someone is literally having these breakdowns or anxiety or feeling these mental blockages here maybe losing sleep um, they could be spying on you or however and seeing how good you're doing here with the Empress and how happy you are and they could be you know either this nine of swords can even be like you know tears crying upset right as they're hiding this so you probably don't even know that they're feeling this way but maybe have an idea okay um let's see what else we have i do love you so yes yeah, someone is very much in does love you here and your intellect arouses me but it's um they love you but there's a lot of resistance here okay a lot of a lot of resistance within the situation now let's get the divine lovers of oracles and see what else is coming in for you guys Ooh. we have mirroring you are reflecting the hidden fears thoughts and emotions of your partner we have fear fear is creating a delay in the forward progression of this partnership and affection an open display of love and special attention to each other's needs is warranted whoops that one wanted to come out let's see what this is reminiscing someone is secretly thinking and replaying sweet memories of the past that is this because they're hiding their feelings here okay um and then we have self-esteem someone is questioning their self-worth and or abilities wow okay now let's go ahead and grab the messages of love oracles and see what else we have coming in for you protected you are safe and divinely guided that it's the will 
I feel. Okay, so you are divinely guided and you are being protected. So that is telling me that you are definitely listening to your intuition and trusting your intuition when going through the unknown um, and trusting the universe and allowing things to unfold naturally here. Ooh, okay. Wait, second chances. Okay. Wait, the timing is not quite right. This relationship deserves a second chance. Yeah, so definitely somebody is wanting that second chance here with you, but I feel like your emotions already have been pulled away from this individual. Um, and I think they're now feeling that, right? As you're here and the outcome as very independent, very independent here. And we have trust. It is safe to trust in this situation. All right, now let's go ahead and pull a card from the Lovers of Oracles and see what else we have for Aries. Whoa. It says, close your eyes and tell yourself that you deserve to feel joyful. You can allow your joy, you can allow joy into your life regardless of the circumstances you currently find yourself in. Beautiful message there. Let's get one more for you guys freedom there is nothing stopping you the path is clear if you want it to be very clear messages here for you guys i am going to leave it right here if you do like this message or if it helped in any way please like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in october god bless